Today in the European Parliament, Azerbaijan offered a new space for cooperation with the EU, the virtual one, an unexpected angle for traditional energy partnership. Azerbaijan put forward an ambitious plan to invest the part of its benefits from natural resources into modernizing the lifestyle of its citizens. The conference focused on exchange of experience of switching to delivery more than 400 governmental services to the citizens via Internet. At the moment, only Estonia among the EU countries is competing with Azerbaijan. Azerbaijan has constituted, we can surely say, say that, a new model of Azerbaijan and Azerbaijani brand, which is, can be useful not only for Azerbaijan, but also for other countries. That Also other countries are interested now in applying this practice and uh, model. Estonia has been as a front runner in this field in the European Union and Azerbaijan has been a very good student. But now the situation is a little bit even changing because Azerbaijan is running even much faster than normally the ordinary EU countries do. They put the political will behind it. Um, you know, clearly it's a, it is a far away Asian country, but of course it's a country that's ra rapidly rising up the League of Prosperity with their uh, tremendous natural resources. And uh, it's pleasing to see that at least some of the resources from that is invested in a, in a good scheme such as this. Digital identification, propagation of a digital single market and the digital agenda is something that's always high up um, our priorities and I'm delighted to be here to give it my support. I do admire Azerbaijan that uh, they managed to do this uh, mobile ID. I think this is really on the cutting edge of modern technology. Actually, they focused on this like already a couple of years ago. Like uh, they wanted to improve the the public services, and they had the money, and they had the goal, and then they just wanted to ex uh, succeed, and then they actually succeeded.